Okay, hi. Today I'm going to show the complex mode of monoid in the phase shows at x570 in x last week calculator. We have mode number two. Okay, number one is calculate. Number two is a complex monoid. You can press two or you can press four. So in this mode, it will let you um, do the complex operation. So for example, you want to key in one's complex number. 3 plus 4i, so 3 plus 4i is this one. Then to do the complex operations, we press option. Here we let you find the argument. Conjugate real part, imaginary part. Okay, converts between r, theta, okay, to the form of a plus bi or a plus bi to the form of r, theta. So first of all, what we're going to do, we're going to okay, change okay, our answer to, okay, we, in the form of A plus B, I, we would like to change it to R and theta. That's what we do one. So we have, the, our answer is actually we have 3 plus 4 I already. So we want to convert it into the R and theta. So R here is 5, this is a angle theta. Okay, and then the next step we are going, okay, now, okay, let's see, we already have the R and theta. We want to change back to A plus B I. Okay, example, okay, we have, um, okay. for example, I have okay. So R is set two, set two. Okay, and then uh, this one. Okay, so this is R. Okay, to get the theta shape PNG. This is how to key in the A 3 plus 4 I 3 plus 4. You click the PNG. Now to input R and theta. So my R let's say is set to theta is so shift PNG to so get this angle. Okay, and let's say it is well, let's say it's pi over 4. Shift okay, R over. Input, okay. So we have got one plus four i. So okay, put number two already just now. Okay, and then um later on I'm going to show okay. okay with the real part number three. Real part of let's say three minus 2 i. So I give you 3. Let's say the 4, imaginary 2 minus 3 i. We give you negative 3. So, so see argument, the argument actually gets an angle. See argument of uh, this one, 3 plus 4 this is argument. So in the options here you can find the argument conjugate real part imaginary part to convert screen the a plus b i to r and theta or from a plus b i to convert back to the r and theta. So thank you. I'm going to show screen to you. Okay, if you want to key in a 3 plus 4 i and put it into a and you put it to b c d. I want to click key in 3 plus 4i and b2 minus i i and later do the complex operation a plus 3b. So key in 3 plus 4i. Okay, and I want to save it into variable a a. So sto. Okay, variable a is here. So on top here. So I press SPO and negative. So 3 plus 4 I store in A. Okay, now I would like to store 2 minus 5i into B. So 2 minus 5i. So SPO B is okay, is here on top of this button. So 2 minus 4k, okay, uh, 2 minus 5i is store in B already. Okay, let's say I'm going to do A plus 3B. 
a plus 3 alpha b. Okay, 9 minus 11 pi is equal. 3 times of a, 6 b. So 9. So this 3 times negative 15 plus 4 b. Okay, so negative 11. So if you want to do this one, 4a divided by b plus 3c plus, this is conjugate of b, conjugate of b. So I need to keep in my c. c is negative 2 plus 5i is 4 to c. 4 to c. Now I want to do these operations. 4a divided by b plus 3c plus conjugate of b. So I have 4 to get a, so alpha a, 4a divided by b, so alpha b plus 3 alpha c and then plus p. Here I want conjugate of b, so you press options, p times 2. So alpha b is here. So can I keep in the b? Can I keep in the b here? Alpha b. So alpha b. So I have a key in b here, I think. So D, okay, I have to input D. D is negative 1, negative I. So negative 1, negative I. It's 4 to whatever D here. Okay, so now call back state. 4A plus D plus 3C plus conjugate D. So this is our answer. This one is minus. So we click. If you input into variable, it will be easier. And then if you want to find the absolute value of C, okay, absolutely, you will see you have the ABS here. ABS. So the value of the C, so alpha C. It's the value of the It is actually equivalent to, you have the square root of K2, 4, K4, and then K4 in 2 squared plus 5 squared. So, third 29, this is correct. So, argument just now, you have shown K between finds the angle of the K complex number D. Under the options there, you can find the argument, conjugate, you can extract the real part, imaginary part. Okay, this is conversion state from A plus B I to R theta or R theta to A plus B I. Okay, and then K. Okay, um, this one converts. So, I think it is K or... So 2 plus 3i. Okay, this way. Okay, you want to store, to store ABCD, that's it, B. Okay, so this is 2 plus 3i store in variable B. If I want to okay, uh, key it into the form, this, this is set to this angle, angle pi over 4, that's what this now, okay. okay. This is set to, to get the angle, shift the ng. Shift PNG okay, and then shift pi divided by 4. Let's say I store to F. Okay, and just now I said we have F. Okay, F is F is okay. Oh, it is written here, you already changed. So mean the options there, if you key in stay in here directly, you get A plus B I. Okay, 
only click in A, you can convert it to R and beta. Okay, I'll answer this now. We already have okay, uh, 1 plus i. That's why it's changed back okay, from okay, just now the answer already okay, 1 plus i. 1 plus i. So that's why I okay, when I click to the answer convert to i and that I get here. And then now, so this is the last answer. If I click. Okay, uh, Number two, okay, eight, one, okay, one plus i. I'll see this one already in r theta. So when I click here, change it back r theta, change it to a plus b i, so you get back one plus i. Okay, so with this case, thank you for your attentions.